feminine. They want you to be soft. They want you to be a woman, you know. All right, so going to the last question, which is, um, can you outgrow or evolve your negative reputation? Now, what made me think of that question was I was listening to Pandora and the uh, Young Jeezy uh, song came on. And, uh, you know, he date that Asian lady. What's it, Jenny May? Jenny, Jenny May. My. My. I don't care about that. But um, <laughs> so the song was um, the one that he got with Lil Duval, but basically was saying like uh, people are going to her, telling her, oh, he's still talking to women, blah, blah, blah. But he was like, they they come to you with that because they know not to come to me with that because like they know I'm with the shit. So I'm like, but I thought he changed. I thought he evolved because when he was up there with Gucci, he was like, we grown men, it's over with, da 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 da, blah, blah, blah. And so I'm like, can people do that? Like, do people really? Does your reputation for being a real nigga is that always there? Even when you become like a family man, a corporate, you know, man, like, is that still there? Can you outgrow your negative reputation? Yeah, it can. Um, you can outgrow it, but that don't mean people go forget it. Okay. And so you can be on a different type of time, like. That may be the case, but sad to say, sometimes you have to remind them of where you came from, whether that's good or bad. And like, a lot of people get that misconstrued because like, oh, you done became soft or you ain't that no more or whatever. And like, you have to show them like, bro, let me remind you whether that's good or bad. And that's that comes more so to a man than a woman. No disrespect or whatever, because we're right, putting right, no right. order where you got to show that or show that ain't nothing changed in a sense but like when you really evolve and become that different level and you really out of that it won't phase you much unless you know it's like a threat right there in front of your face you know what I'm saying? anything right. else ain't moving you to even act on it or give it attention but i think you can evolve from that it got to be like some wild junk. I know you're going to always look at a thief as a thief, whether he ain't stole nothing in 10 years or not. But like, you know what I'm saying? Maybe he don't steal no more, but you still have to deal with the fact that you know you don't steal no more, but there's people out there that still going to look at you as a thief as whether you act on it or not. That's so true. Like, I feel like that was like the perfect answer. And I feel like that goes for not even just, you know, a guy's reputation is kind of being like whatever this street person or or whatever rep that he has, I think that goes for anything. Like you mentioned, like if you have a negative rep, like you can evolve from that. But just because you evolve, like some somebody always going to remind you of who, who you used to be or what you used to do. You know, you can be evolved and, you know, that ain't been your character in, in, in 10 years. You know, you don't even move. You don't even move with the same people. Like you ain't even in the same neighborhood no more. Like everything about you has changed. Like literally, right, right. they don't even know who you are anymore. Like they know, they know Sean from high school. They know this person from in this era. Like they literally can look at you now. Yeah, they think they know you, but they have no idea of who you are because you evolved and changed so much. But I think right. you brought up a good point. You know, even still, and you're growing and evolving. You can do all those things, but that doesn't mean that everybody's going to accept the evolve you. You know, I feel like you have to be content yourself to know, like, that was my reputation before, or that's who I was before. That's not me now, and I'm walking into the new person that I am. That doesn't say everybody is going to accept you for the new person that you are, but I feel like that's just saying that me, myself, I know who I am, and I know the, the person that I evolved into, and that's what I'm going to step into, and that's what I'm going to show. But it, 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 I feel like it's always going to be somebody who's going to want to bring you back or want to remind you like, oh, yeah, you used to do this. Or even when it comes to like relationship, I shouldn't say relationship wise or, you know, males and females, you know, everybody, you know, I feel like you have to decide for yourself. It might be this person that, you know, has a negative rep, whether that's being in the streets, whether that's, um, you know, sleeping with other people, whatever the case may be, you may be like, you know, yeah, that's something I did. It was in my past. I'm not that person no more. But it's up to that person to decide like, okay, I, I'm, I'm trying to mess with this evolved person or like, nah, you know, I know she, she or he got his stuff together now, but I just can't get over with it. Like, that's not saying that is right or wrong. That's just saying that they made a choice. They made a choice to either walk it with you or they just made a choice to distance themselves like that's up to them right. and I feel like as long as you content you good 
I, I, I agree uh, with Chastity. Chastity said most of the time you get that reminder when you're doing positive things, like you're doing better than them. That's yeah. most definitely true. That's you know. That's definitely you, that's awesome. like whether you evolved or not. You know if you evolve when the reminders come up and they don't phase you no more in the sense. And like those reminders are for you to take in a positive way and, and remind yourself like look how much I grew or where I didn't came from. And like I look at I use that shit a lot because like the average the average female gonna be like that boy are they a hoe or like that boy they didn't have some women or whatever and like mm. I would love to scream to the top of the hills like I ain't on that type of time no more my grown ass man. nah like you know what I'm saying I'm about to be thirty Friday but like yeah you know you, you, you said know, Friday you happy yeah, early like, birthday yeah happy early birthday you know like you evolve from that jump when you don't care to explain to every person that feels like you still on that same Listen, yeah, I don't and you comment to strangers to. I don't talk to strangers like when people comment under my shit on my it, Instagram YouTube Facebook when I I don't people be like you script you seen that baby I don't reply to strangers <laughs> I don't know you so what you saying don't face me but you know and people are also watching they're watching to see how you respond because what yeah. they're gonna do is pick and 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 so they can they get a spark and they can say oh yeah I know he ain't changed look at him. look at him doing this like oh I know she ain't changed because they've been pushing your buttons just to make just to so they can make or see what they can see if the old person is gonna come out. They just that's, keep that's passing. when you block them. That's when you block their ass. I, that's but not, but not even like on no, but not even like on those social media type stuff. Like, or like on, in real life. Yeah, like just people that just want to do things just to taunt you. Like they, they want you to go back to the old person. Like they want you to prove. They want you to prove that you've evolved. So they're gonna push every button can push, and people are really looking at that. They're like, okay, let me see. Especially if you're the type of person who, you know may have had the reputation of being like, uh, I don't know, like a fighter or somebody that's all about drama, whatever the case may be. You'd be like, you know, I ain't about no drama no more. You know, I'm just, you know, on my positive stuff. Like somebody gonna bring some drama to you. Somebody gonna stir up the pot just to see. Let, let me see if she really bought this whole evolution and change stuff she's talking about. Listen, all I, the people that's gonna try to bring you back. People love a reaction. And just like you said, like they gonna do that just to be like, just to not even necessarily get you to prove it, but to see it just come out. Like, I'm not on no drama. They gonna bring drama to you. As soon as you start to react, they're gonna be like, there it go. Yeah. <laughs> I, I love, I, I don't love it because it's negative, but I just love to see when people be like, when they are positive, and then <laughs> they always do the, they be like, I don't normally go live because I don't normally do this, but, and I'm like, oh my go. gosh, I hate when Here people do that. They I hate when go. they get on live and be like, oh, I'm like, what you do don't this. do, baby? What you don't do? Because you do that. You be on live. Like, they be like, I don't even get on live. I'm like, I just seen you on live last week talking about that thing. That's what you're talking about. Okay, according to my notifications, you do go on live. Like, what are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about? But, um, I agree. Um, we, uh, uh, Sean, that was a great response. Um, as far as Whitney saying, like, uh, important about off the internet, like on some real life stuff, like I believe in the motto, don't let nobody trick you off the streets, you know, um, cause ain't nobody gonna take care of your family, your people, like how you do. And, you know, um, motherfuckers are, are do some dumb shit to get you locked up. And then they'd be the first ones be like, hashtag free or real nigga. Like, <laughs> God, that shit burns me up. Because if you wanted your homeboy to be free, you would have held him back or not even, you know, but that's another topic which we won't talk about, you know. But um, it was good. It was great. I want to say thank you, Sean. Yeah, thank you. Um, Keep 